Hello, hi, and welcome. It is Zai Omogashi. My name is Virtus, and we shall be playing a new game of 2023. I don't know much about it, but I saw it in my Xbox um, as a new game to play. So we're gonna we're just gonna jump into it. So far, looks cool, Jazzy. What's your third sona? What third sona? Oh no. I don't know if a dating quiz is the best distraction from the disaster you've made of your life. A dating quiz? What, girl? What do you mean by dating quiz? Why is it a quiz? Huh, girl? But hey, what do I know? You're the one in charge here, Jala. Oh, okay. So her name is Jala. Oh, the music is quite nice, actually. It's hard hitting. What did you do, Jala? You better answer honestly, though. You can't keep any secrets from me. Uh oh, why not? You're narrator. You can't keep secrets. Okay, so we're skating in this very interesting world for geometric shapes. Oh, that was not good. Don't push A. That is the tip unless you want to jump. Your day shows up in a terrible outfit. People are staring. What's your reaction? Your son, I quiz. I'm embarrassed, but stay. I leave. I don't care. Do I care? Do I though? I feel like I would stay, but I'd be a little bit embarrassed as to why they're looking. If people are gonna stare, it should be for the right reasons. No way I'd go on a second date. What, Jala? I mean, who cares if you stare, but you know, I'm, I don't want too much attention on me. But I would, I would potentially go on a second date. Oh sure. What's the point of a romantic partner if they're not a status symbol? Uh oh. Okay, boys and girls, let's get going. Oh, oh, the loopsies. Oh, what's your worst quality as a romantic partner? I'm aloof, I'm flicky, I'm needy. Well, if we gotta be honest, I'm a bit needy, but I should be telling you that. Why do you need to know my secrets? I just like detailed feedback. I mean, how else would I know what I need to work on? That is true. That is true. That is true. All oh, right. Yeah, I'm a bit needy. So what? Standardized testing really did a number on you. Yes. How are you supposed to know my secrets? Oh, you walk on those? Ooh. Your partner says I love you way too soon. What do you do when you're under pressure? I perform, I lash out, I ghost. Um, I do the same back, I guess. Yeah, I would do the same back. I don't want them to feel awkward about it. You just put a smile on your face and say it back, right? That's what I do. Not if you don't mean it. Oh. But maybe I do. I mean, how do you know how you feel really? Sometimes you just have to decide right yeah make a plan carry it through fake it till you make it ah yes yes this is why your romantic life is a trash fire your romantic life is a trash fire how dare you don't insult us you carefully plan date goes completely wrong what do you do i go with the flow so make a new plan. I go with the flow. Who cares? Whatever. Ha! Your plan can't go wrong if you didn't make one in the first place. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Speaking of plans. Oh, who is that? Holy hell! Oh, what? You know her? Are you ever planning to call me back, Jala? Is it? Uh, is that your exes? I haven't heard your voice in six months. Six months? Oh. Your sister's such a bore. <laughs> Good thing you have me instead. What? That's your sister? Oh, the glasses make sense. <laughs> the glasses make sense. You're the same person. We're really not. You imagined me with her face, but I'm the voice inside your head. Oh, but you give her your face, her face, okay. I know things about you she could never begin to understand. Well, of course, because you're inside of me. You're in my brain. You're my inner voice and inner thoughts. We're way closer than sisters, Jala. You're, you're, yes, yes, that's true. How do I do this? What? I'm afraid. I have fear in my eyes. Oh! Ooh. I saved myself for a disaster. Turn the skateboard. Okay, we're good. Just don't push A. Don't jump. What are you most thirsty for? Success, safety, freedom. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Success. I mean, if you're rich and you got a bed, you know what you could do? Fix those problems with therapy. <laughs> you could fix those problems with therapy, okay? Safety. To have safety, you gotta be healthy. Freedom. Freedom can cause issues, okay? Success. Because you could buy therapy with money. I want to be the best. But your best is never enough. Is oh. It? And whose fault is that, Ma? We put too much pressure on you, Jala. No wonder you cracked. Hey, I don't get any crack. Just say you're disappointed, Appa. I know you are. I let everyone down. Ouch. Still think it's a good idea to go home? They all hate you, Jala. Can you blame them? No, they can't hate me. I'm too beautiful. But what did you do, Jala? Shut up. Ugh, fine. Guess I'll leave you to skate away your feelings. Yes, I'll skate away my feelings. Oh, my mom and dad, don't look at me. Don't look at me while it's work on the board. Ooh. Oh, I saved myself. Have you ever been in love? This damn there's Sonoquid. Yes, I have been. Wait, am I, am I answering for her or answer for me? Well, I have been. I don't know about Jala. That's none of your business. Oh, that's true. It is none of your business. Why are you making us tell our feelings? Who's that? Just answer the question, Jala. Uh-oh. Tyler? Don't I deserve an answer? Uh-oh. <laughs> is that one your exes? Jala, are you... Are you into the women's? The women's? Isn't that why you're on a bus back home? Because you owe me an answer? Ooh, you better tell your woman what you did. You better give her an answer to, I mean, Jala. Yeah. You're right. Uh oh Did you love me, Jala? <gasps> oh my god, the three-letter word. Did you love her, Jala? Did you love her? I did. Oh, you did. <laughs> I thought it would help to hear you say that. But it just makes everything worse. Oh, that's that, that, that's not very good. I loved you, Jala, but you already knew that. Ugh. You broke my heart. Oh, that is extremely awkward. Don't stare at me. Don't stare at me and remind me of my problems. We have to remember to do like Jala. Oh, who's all these people? Before the results, why don't we just ask your exes what they think of you? Uh oh. Should be illuminating. Selfish. Selfish. Liar. Liar. Arrogant. Arrogant. Cruel. Uh. Cheetah. Oh. Harmless. Damn, you're at all these things in a boat, aren't you? Congratulations, your Thursona is... Well, yeah, what is my Thursona? The star. Oh. You never see it coming, but there's just something about you 
people find irresistible. You crave status and approval. So wonderful. Great for have me. Have you ever asked yourself why you need to be liked so much? I need to be liked because I need to let I, people need to know how amazing I am. Okay, I like the attention. Okay, okay. I'm lying to myself. We oh, yeah. got the star. Oh, we're a 3D character. What up, girl? Where we going? It's nighttime. It's hella late. Timber Hills, our hometown. Oh, is it? I still don't get why we're back here. Yeah, why are we back here, Jella? Can you tell us in the audience? You're like a serial killer driven to return to the scene of the crime. Oh, <laughs> there she! How dare she make it like that? No money died. Like a person taking responsibility, I have nowhere else to go. I'm trying to take responsibility. I'm not here to relive the past. I'm here to make up for it. Yes, right. You don't fix things, Jala. You break them. Hey, we're working on it. Right, Jala? I can change. Yes, everyone can change. Give us a chance. You're just going to hurt yourself. All you're doing is picking at scabs. Shh, we can try. Should you be inspiring and helpful? Coming back here was a mistake. No, no it isn't. Leaving was the mistake. Exactly. Everyone we love is here, right? This is the hometown. You're being selfish, as usual. I'm not being selfish. You are, narrator. I know nothing about you. <laughs> Uh, this is very awkward, talking to your inner self. I don't know why I even bother trying to help you. You're hopeless. Are you... are you the good... are you my guts? Or are you my inner demons, narrator? Tell me. Where are we going? Find a ride home. Okay. Cookie. Pet Macha Chan. Ma Machan. This is a very nice diner. With people with no faces. Wait, Doggy, I want to look around a little bit quick. Okay, you don't mind. What? We could talk to these damn people too? I know that. Okay, let me talk to him. Or her. What is this? Oh, is it a rhythm game or what? No rhythm? Oh. Boy. Oh shoot, I messed up. I'm better than you, doggy. You, you're sucking my hand. Thank you, doggy. I think I did good. Hello. Oh, they were in green. I appreciate it. What? Two spots. Yeah, put the music on. Wow. Oh. Let's sit we about can't our problems. hang out at the diner all night. But we can sit here and think about our issues. You need to call someone to give you a ride home. Ooh, and who should I be? Who's it gonna be? My parents, my older sister, my ex best friend. Who's your ex best friend? <sighs> Maybe I should just call Tyler and get it over with. I mean, yes, Tyler's your ex bestie, but she's also your ex. The ex. Wait, your best friend is also your ex girlfriend? Ooh, you date your best friend? Ouch. Girl, you know what you happens you date your best friend? It shows. And given the way you ended things. Oh no, how did you end things, Jala? I don't know about Jala's side or the narrator's. She probably hates my guts. Oh. Probably. I mean, she should love you enough to give you a ride home, yeah? Okay, she definitely hates me. Sorry, sis. The truth hurts, but it'll set you free. How about my older sister? We love each other, right? Aruni's probably still up. That's gonna go well. You haven't called her in months. Oh. Why would you? You have me to talk to instead. <laughs> you want to talk about how amazing you are? 
You can't drive us home like can you? I'm clearly the superior version. But crucially, you can't drive a car. Ooh. Wow. Way to rub it in. You think I like only existing in your head? Well, no, but... I could call home and hope that dad picks up instead of mom. Oh. That means mom's the more strict one. It's after 10 p.m. What if you give dad a heart attack? Why would he get a heart attack? He will not die. Mom's had him on a low cholesterol diet since we were kids. <laughs> low diary. You really want to test that. You know he sneaks cashew nuts from the cupboard when she's not looking. Oh, that's bad for your health. Um, when you have a diet. Uh, Jala, remember when I said coming back here was a mistake? No, it's not. How can you fix your problems if you're just running away? You got to confront them head on. Is it a good time to say I told you so? What? Already? I hope you're ready for some long delayed emotional catharsis. Because your third grade boyfriend just walked in the door. <gasps> no. Who's the third grade boyfriend? Sergio? Sergio? Who's Sergio? Oh. You got chest hair down. Why does he pose like that? What a poser. Look at his jewelry. Who do you think you are, sir? You have nice pants, I think, though. Jealous, sturdy boyfriend, overconfident, insecure, macho, needy, and far, far, far too thirsty. This level, hi, Sergio. How about we retrack and, you know, leave? His mustache, though, he looks like an evil villain, and he got purple hair, too. Uh oh, what's this? You look surprised to see me, Jala. Or are you just admiring the view? The view of your ass? Or the view of your, your non-existent abs? Shut him down. Make a joke. Shut him down. Make a joke. You look ready for a Bollywood close-up, and I feel like an extra in a bad horror movie. <laughs> Way to make a girl feel inadequate. Wait, she's a Bollywood. Is he Indian? What? No, no, you look gorgeous, as always. She's just dressed like a stereotypical teen, uh, cool teen adult woman. One of these days, we really have to talk about your susceptibility to cheap flattery. Don't, don't fall for it. So, it's been a while. Why is she in a stance like she's about to fight? Look at her abs, you guys. Dang, she got those abs. She lives. Three years, two months, and 14 days. Why have you been counting? <clears throat> did I just say that out loud? You did. I take everything back. This is the most fun I've had in months. You should not have fun, narrator. Sergio's had it bad for Jala since Mrs. Garcia made them project partners in third grade. Uh-oh. His crush survived the geography club after school incident, puberty, and Jala's extremely public on-again, off-again romance with Tyler all through high school. Ooh. All through high school. On and off. That does not sound healthy. His thirst is kind of pathetic, but you can't deny he has stamina. Stamina for what, son? <clears throat> anyway, how's Jennifer? Who's Jennifer? I don't know. Probably in Seattle with her new girlfriend. Oh. Wow. She's over you, maybe. Or in hell, with any luck. You're single? <laughs> Seriously. No, I'm not interested in you. Would you believe I am too? <sighs> yeah, I would. <laughs> you reek of desperation. Why is he dancing like that? What the heck is he doing? <laughs> Why is he dancing like that? He's such a poser. He's so flashy. I don't like his haircut. This is Bollywood music, I do. Ah! Come on, Sergio. Let's dance. Did I mention I spent a year abroad? I learned a lot of new moves in Milan. Aren't you Milan? Damn, you rich. 
I hope you're ready, because I have a few new moves of my own. Yeah, buddy boy. Watch out. What do I have to lose? Many things. Your hair, your earrings, your necklace, your watch. I'll rip them off your body. Oh, wait, that sounds weird. <laughs> Never mind. Your dignity? Oh, wait. Just remember, Jala, there are no winners in a psychodrama battle with your third grade boyfriend. I will win. Only losers. Oh. Just kidding. You could both win the prize of friendship and emotional maturity. How does that sound? I prefer cake. That's not a real prize. That's actually nice. It's actually kind of nice. Oh, look, you're growing as a person already. Oh, really? No Hinty. love. Uncle Hinty. He kind of looks a little sketchy, but he's our uncle, so you must love him, right? Also, he only has a little bit of hair in the front, but it's okay, and he has his weird glasses. <laughs> Press A at the right time to enhance your attack or defense. Oh, okay. Wait for the shrink circle to overlap with the ring around the A. We'll pause again to show the right correct timing. Indeed. This is the right moment. Oh, okay. There are options in the game for you to make it easier. Next time, you have to do it your own. Oh, okay. Finally, gonna be my dad's favorite son. Oh, aren't you an only child? Oh, that's not good. <gasps> Bye, boy. I still think about our first kiss. You remember? On the trip to the Seattle Aquarium in third grade. Ooh. It was so magical. Is Seattle near Timber? Timber Hills. Our lips touching. Bathed in the blue green light of the tank, surrounded by moon jellies. First are boring. All fish, all first kisses are magical. I wish I could forget. First are boring. Ugh, why is everyone so obsessed with firsts? The patriarchy? Yes. Right? And most first times are disappointing anyway. What was I? Disappointing? Uh, yes. Now stop hitting on me. Ugh. You had sweaty little hands. My hands were not sweat. Okay, maybe they were a little... You... Nasty. I was probably really nervous. That's not the point. It's the point. Third grade was pretty traumatic for me, you know? My parents got divorced, my dad left town... And never really looked back. His mom spoiled him rotten to make up for it, which didn't work, obviously. You're the only good thing I can remember from that time. We shared something special, Jala. Um, if I'm married correctly, Jala seems gay. I mean, Jala's most important ex-girlfriend seems to be a woman. And the girl that she was last with since you asked was Jennifer, which is also a woman. So I don't think she plays on her team, buddy. With the break it through. No love. You turned me down at prom. I'm not gonna let you turn me down again. Oh good, you did. Good job, Jala. I'm so proud of you. You can do better. My mom than this. says she sees girls look at me everywhere I go. Yeah, that's the thing. Your mom says fool. Your mom. Only one I have eyes for. Ew. Then maybe you need to get your eyes checked. Hey Jala, have you noticed Sergio's really thirsty for you? Ooh, don't tell me, narrator. It's so dead obvious. It's desperation. You should try using that to your advantage. Hinti. Try using a thirst taunt on Sergio. Okay, Uncle Hinti. Hello. Are we flirting or are we fighting? Why not both? You. <laughs> I'm so sick of entitled dicks like you. Ooh. Indeed. Now you put Sergio in a thirsty mood. Follow up with a thirsty skill for extra damage. Go to boss. Me. I see the scared little boy hiding behind all that swagger. Oh, you think he's swag? Boy, Sony tell you the truth. 
you, 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 you. What kisses this hell? Oh, he fell. Are you trying to hurt my feelings? Why are you so mean to me? Why you can't you take no for an answer, boy? Oh, please. You love it. Oh. Dude, he got a... Never mind. Oh, never mind. I don't want to say it. <laughs> he got a... He got a... Um... He likes to be bullied. I son. Does your mom still pick out your clothes for you? Or do you just have the same taste? Ooh, that is. That is that's coming out hot. What a loser. Oh. Guess what, Jala? I've been training with your Auntie Chandra. Ew, don't treat my aunt. Creep. Auntie Chandra would never let you skip leg day. Bulky legs would ruin the fall of my pants. I'm going for a more elegant silhouette. Um, right. I don't like you. Don't talk to him anymore. <laughs> Damn. Why don't... You can't deny we look good together, Jala. We do not look good together. You're lying to me and you're lying to yourself. Think about it. You... We could run this whole town. I don't want to run this town. I want to run away from you. Or at the very least, my dad's used car empire. Yay, daddy issues. Sounds like a business deal. You don't know me. Maybe you want to live in your daddy's shadow your whole life. Ooh, yikes. But all I want is to get away from everyone's expectations. You tell him, sis. Okay, fair enough. I'll support you. You can do anything you want with me by your side. It's not about more money. Is this what you want? Wait, what, do you, what do you want, fool? Do you really want to take over your dad's business? I want him to be proud of me. That doesn't mean the same thing, boy. He thinks I'm shallow. That I won't amount to anything. Everyone does. Dude, come on, man. Who cares what your dad thinks? Yeah, who cares? Do what you please. Do what you want. That is the goal. That is the dream. My God, come on, man. Your mom thinks the sun shines out of your butt. Oh yeah, it shines out of his ass. <laughs> and she's the one who actually stuck around. See, that's the one you should really think about, man. See, that's exactly what I need in my life, Jala. Someone to tell me the truth. Thank you, Mama, though. Even when I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it either. No more. Don't ask me no more. I can't let you go again. Let me go. If you love me, you let me go. <laughs> if you love me, man, let me go. I've been waiting a long time Ew. to get a few things off my chest. Oh my god. Look at his chest hair. He's so obsessed with himself. Oh, What is this? Why does he change? What is he wearing? Inner world? I love you, Jala. I have loved you since our hands met reaching for the same tub of lime green Play-Doh in third grade. That's sweet. You have bad timing. No, you don't. Love me? This is the longest conversation we've had in over a decade. Yeah? And whose fault is that? Uh, yours. Because you're so catastrophically weird when we do talk. <laughs> She's just ja taking jabs at this man. This thing between us. It's real, Jala, and I'm gonna prove it to you. Why are you even into us? We're denying everything you're saying, man. Look at this man floating and stuff. What the heck? Come on now, not floating cars. This man. What? Why is he invulnerable? What the hell? I can't make a dent. This is Sergio's inner world. Oh my god. In here, he's the person he desperately wishes he could be out there. Cool, smooth, invulnerable to attack. Is that right? Impeccably waxed. Focus. If you want to get anywhere, you have to shatter that invulnerability by summoning a terrifying psychological specter. Like what? Like most South Asian men, all it takes to destroy Sergio's ego is a single word from his mom. Oh, yes, he's Indian. But since we can't bring her into this, we have to summon the next best thing. What is that? Our mom. Oh, our mom. Indeed. Using mom summon skill to break through Sergio's inner vulnerability. 
Okay, Uncle Hinky. Cry with me. Boy, cry your damn self. Where is it? Mom, help me. Mom! Smack for the lifetime. What we gotta do? What happening? Mama! Oh yeah, she definitely in there. Look Not at the mom. No! She, she, gave, she gave him the flip flop. I can't believe you brought your mom into this. And so you started it. I guess it's a good sign. You want me to meet your parents? Aren't you optimistic? <laughs> He's optimistic way too much. That's no more love. With all the toxic masculinity Sergio's got going on. Ooh, toxic masculinity? Hell no. Jealous, say no. I kind of suspect he'd be really easy to put into a rage. Try it. Okay. Indeed. Try a rage taunt on Sergio. Ooh, do it. Do it, Jaya. Didn't you have a shrine of me in your locker in middle school? Oh, a shrine? The janitor made you throw it out at the end of the semester. It wasn't a shrine. It was a tasteful collection of basketball memorabilia. Oh, ew. Indeed. That worked. Now follow up with the rage skill. I got you, my boy, my boy. I got you. Boy. Oh, boy. Oh, he's like skinny. Ugh. Do you like the fact that I stick around even when you insult me? Mm. You're so desperate, it's actually a little pathetic. Yeah, it's pathetic, man. Wow, don't sugarcoat it. Well, he did ask. He did. What is this? No more love. <laughs> Nobody turns me down, Jala. Not anymore! I'm a new man now! Oh, someone did turn you down. Yikes. You think those muscles and bravado are fooling anyone? I see right through you. Yes, I do. I see you through. The same insecure little boy in a bigger package. Ew. <laughs> well, you see how skinny that boy's legs are? He's good leg, leg day for sure. Come on, let's knock him out. Go to a garbage room, please. Look at his legs. It will not match his upper body. That is. It's time for you to leave grade school behind, Sergio. Yeah, I'm grossed out. Sorry. You're definitely not jealous type. Say no. Say no, sis. Do you get off on emasculating me, Jala? I bet this is all a game to you. It is a game. It's not to me. Indeed. Dead. Your willpower is real low. How about trying some basic tactics to regain some WP? Okay. Oh. Bye. Makeup. You sweat out your difference. Now you can be friends or something more. No. Nothing more. Jala's only going for women. She was dating a woman before and the VX is a woman. Let's be besties, I guess. We can be friends. Nothing more. I'm sorry I came on so strong, Jala. That's that's damn right, boy. I've had this fantasy of you in my head for so long. It's time I got to know the real you. See, man, take notes. This is the real way to become friends with women. I'm ready to move on if you are. I'm glad we figured that out. Because... I kinda need a favor. Oh, you can ask him for the ride. We did it. Oh wait, what does it mean recent points? We did it, guys. We got a rough uh, right from Sergio. Thanks for Sergio Flex. I mean Sergio Flex. Well, where did he drop us off at? Who's all these people? Where's the emergency? You told me one of the neighborhood cats got run over. Yeah, about that. I lied. 
Uh, so I take it you didn't get me an interview with one of the skate punks? No, better. Sergio has some big news. What big news? Jal is back! Oh, shoot. Why are you telling them? Who are these people? Are they my exes? She's in Timberhills. And she's not with Jennifer anymore. Hmm, who could have seen that coming? So what? So, we're all Jala's exes. I thought everyone would want to know. They don't want to know. Jelly Beans is back? That is big news. Ew, Jolly Beans, don't tell me that. So, did you confess your love, or did you throw up before you got the words out? Uh, I did. Confess, I mean. Not throw up. Sorry, Tyler. I know you two have your whole big doomed romance thing. Had. There's a crater where we used to be. It's extinct. I'm over her. Girl, you never, you can't be over me. Have you seen Jella? Jella, you know, we cannot send not to Jella. Whatever, Tyler. I'm going to make her fall for me and then crush her. Huh? You want me to fall for you, then crush me? Oh, God. That doesn't sound very emotionally healthy. See, he knows. Oh, what isn't healthy about long overdue revenge for being humiliated in middle school by your first crush? What? Was that? Was Jala your first crush? Ooh, fiery and gorgeous. How have we never met before? I'd remember you. You. Down, boy. She doesn't play for your team. Oh. I mean, she's lesbian. She's gay. Sorry. Ahem. I was thinking we could all get closure. Maybe even be friends. Why would the, why would the exes be friends with each other? <laughs> oh, wait. You're joking, right? The rest of you can do whatever the hell you like. But trust me on this. The last thing I want is to be Jala Jairatna's friend. Jala Jairatna? Jairatna? Thirsty suitors. Chapter 1. This is your mess, Jala. Jala's back in Timber Hills and we coincide with her third grade boyfriend, Sergio. His shiny new biceps definitely helped. You. Next up on the, on the reconciliation tour, her family. Uh oh. Oh, I like his necklace. But. Ew to his abs, I mean his biceps. But then again, if you look at Tyler, she got some nice biceps too. Where am I? Jala, is that how you come down the stairs? Sergio gave you a Sergio Flex Charm. I don't want to wear it. It can help you do critical hits with their skills. But you have to equip it. Ah, oh, fine. Open the gear menu and put it on your phone. Eventually, you will get more slots for charms, B, but right now you can only use one at a time. Okay. Where is it? There's snow. Gear, he said. Oh, we can change our outfit too eventually. Too much pink. Ew, we don't want that. But we can use. Look okay, at we can put. About four of them. Talk to mom and dad. Okay. Up. Appa. Oma. Is that what she called them? Jala. Hello, man. You're awake. I couldn't sleep because I'm hungry. <laughs> That's what I would say. Something smells good down here. I've missed your cooking, mom. You have. Well, of course you have. It's impossible to get a good meal in this country without paying through the nose or... What? Or making it yourself. Yeah, Mom, I know. I made breakfast, but don't expect to be waited on hand and foot while you're staying here. Since Aruni moved out, I'm out of the habit of cleaning up after messy children. Why did Aruni move out? Where's Aruni? How do you and Dad feel? Why did your sister move out? Did you guys get into a fight or something? No, Jala. I'm not so terrible a mother that both my children feel the need to flee into the night. Oh, so you fled into the night. 
Jelly, you got I got some explaining to do. It wasn't about you, liar. Oh. Well, it wasn't just about you. Oh, it's even worse. Oh yes. Your dad and me staying up worried sick night after night wondering whether you were okay. She's okay. <laughs> If it makes, you know, I kind of I kind of relate. I also ran away from home, but that's a story for another day. Maybe a little story time. Wondering what we had done wrong. Abort mission, Jala. Abort. Abort. Abort mission now. What we did to deserve being cut out of your life? Of course. None of that was about us. Uh, I need to talk to her. How do you dead feel? Are you and dad doing okay on your own? Empty nest and all that? Yes, empty nest. Aruni is not the one who's been giving us sleepless nights. Better question is, are you okay? I take it that girl finally got tired of you. Thanks for the sympathy. Aren't you happy? Good guess. I thought you'd be jumping for joy. I would have been. Three years ago, two and a half years ago, two years ago, even last year. Damn, she was gone for three entire years. Oh, God, that's a long time. Long time. I had to stop hoping you would come home. So it's hard to be happy all of a sudden. Um, I need to talk to me, I think. She's not answering my texts. I wonder why. You better make it right with her, Jala. And soon. She's getting married at the end of the month. Why didn't you tell me? That's kind of important news to share, Mom. Usually, I'm all aboard the blame Mom for everything train. But I think this signal failure is on you, sweetie. <laughs> oh, you said right. Jala, what did you do, girl? This is your mess, Jala. You clean it up. Aww. Okay. <laughs> hey, well, I hate her to say that. But she's right, she's right. Morning, Jala Banana. Oh, good morning, Dad. It's good to see you, Apache. Oh, and she calls him Apache. He's so cute. I wish I could call my dad Apache. It's okay, I'll call my cat Dad. <laughs> but then my cat will be my dad. Never mind, it doesn't matter. You too, sweetie. You know, you're my favorite younger daughter. Hmm? You're home. Back where you belong. That's all that matters. I don't want to stay, don't say that. I want to fix things. I know where else to go. Let's say that's something nice. Your dad seems nice. Your mom seems strict, but she still loves you. I made a mistake when I left. I need to put it right. Yes. Well, at least you can admit it was a mistake. That's something. It's not going to be the same as it was, Jala. But that's okay too, you know? There's a Buddha statue over there. I appreciate that. <laughs> My parents are Buddhist, so I recognize it. I need to talk to Aruni. Do I even know who she's marrying? Yeah, who's she marrying? Do you even know if you're invited to the wedding? Uh-oh. Amma! Well, you didn't talk to her. How long did you not talk to your sister, girl? She didn't assume. It's Aruni's choice, Jala. Not ours. Don't look so defeated, Jala. This is a small town full of gossiping aunties. Gossiping aunties, that's hilarious. How hard could it be to track your sister down if you put your mind to it? Hmm, good point. Okay, where are we going now? Find so, downtown. I guess we just skate around Arnie's favorite spots downtown till we find her? Oh. Do you even want to find her? It's not going to be a fun conversation. I need to yell at her. I'm not here for fun. I won't find her. She's avoiding me, so she's probably going to be avoiding all our usual places. Still, at least it gets me out of mom's glare zone. Yeah. Okay, great point. Get on your skateboard and let's get out of here. Yes, avoid our problems. What is this? Oh, is that Jala and her sister? Her sister's lighter than us. Was it sixth grade when I fell off my scooter, land on my face, and then there was blood everywhere? Ew. Fifth, the whole neighborhood heard you crying. You ran to my rescue, cleaned me up, and took care of me until Dad got home. I had my moments. Mom and Dad treated us to ice cream at Yaya's that day. Wow. Huh, the map looks nice. But there's five black 
black stickers of people. So I'm guessing that's our exes. But we already met Sergio. I could tell by his haircut that Sergio. Find Oroni. Okay, we find Oroni. Wait, I'll open a can. Thirsty. Oh wait, not for that though. <laughs> what up? Oh. Why are there people with the bear mask? Enter diner. Who are we here to meet? Hey, Doge. Even Aroni is not dumb enough to be to enough to be avoiding you at her fair spot. Oh, or maybe she assumed we won't look for her here, making it a perfect hiding place. Guess we're better taking a look around just in case. Hi, Jala. You want your regular? My regular? Fried eggs, extra crispy bacon, hash browns covered in bacon fat. Oh, you fat. I suggest pancakes, but you said, and I quote, Pancakes are for people who can't commit to the soul strengthening grease of classic egg meat potato diner breakfast. Wow, this reader knows you well, girl. Your blood must be consistent of tart now. Aha, uh -huh, I don't remember it. I don't remember that. I tried eat to eat better these days. Ugh, adults are boring bodies. I relate so much. God, high school was the best. Milkshakes then? Oh yeah. Thanks. Did we have to pay for that? Was that free? That is the question. Was that free? How about you guys? Concert? The concert was a flop? How much did you pay? More than twenty dollars. Oh my god. Oh, she's not here. I don't see her guys. Let's head out. Bad doggy with the eyelashes. Doggy got big old eyelashes. No one they're not here. I mean she's not here. Hold on me. She needs a few the bear mask. Where is that girl? Yeah. Oh, what's that? A mysterious box. We must open it. Okay, here it goes. I don't want to open it. How about something dangerous? Grit or gift? Grit. Oh no. What is that? Patty Suter. Indian? Indian. March Marcho ads come to life. Sent to you with love, Patty. Uh oh. Hey! Are you Jala? Jala Jaya Ratna? Jala Ra Ratna. I'm not Indian, so I don't know how to say these. I've been looking for you all over town. But I, I will try to learn. Who's asking? Who, you know me? Sorry, dude. Did we go to school together or something? Your party thought we'd be a good match. My grandma sent you? That woman is a menace. And I mean that with the deepest respect. Yes, deep respect. You really didn't know I was coming? No, I really didn't. Oh, well. Hope you like surprises, Jala. No, I like women. <laughs> That's what she should say. Because I'm here and I'm ready to settle down with a girl like you. Oh. Indeed. That, Jala, it sounds like it would be easy for you to shock this guy. Try using the shock taunt and follow it with a shocking skill. I got to shock the fool. Aren't you bored of living the life your parents want from you? Uh oh, that hurt. Come on, beat him up, beat him up. Really, that was no ankle breaker. Boy, fine. Is my pomade keeping its hold? What's a pomade? Oh. Bye. Your determination just makes you more attractive to me. Disgusting. Shame, I think you're pathetic. Now, scram. Don't open the gifts no more. Your lies. But I do wonder, would there ever be a gift in those? Heartless, do the heart. 
You know what can help us find anti find uh our only the gossip queen of Timber Hills or Anti Chantra. She does not usually play favorites, but it's worth a shot. She'll be at the body shop, flirting with any passing librarians or single moms with a car trouble. Oh, she a. She said flirted with any passing librarians. Come on, most librarians are girls. And single moms? Come on, gay. Be radar. Auntie Chantra, are you gay? I need to know, girl. Hey, girl. Where's she at? Where's she talking? Oh, Jala. It's so good to see you. Well, oh, has a relief. Wish everyone felt that way. I kind of wondered if I was going to get the guilt trip. Yeah, you skipped town for three years for a girl named Jennifer. Maybe some other time. I don't like to kick a girl when she's down. Oh, Auntie's nice. It's just less fun, you know? You are utterly terrifying, Auntie Chandra. And don't you forget it. This being Auntie. So, weird thing just happened. What happened? Your grandmother sent an army of potential suitors to Timber Hills to ambush you? Why would she do that? I know Bhakti loves me and all, but Aruni's always been her favorite. Oh. Well, I was here first, you know. But you're not really... You know what I mean. Am I going to be dodging marriage proposals every time I walk down the street? Hmm. Do you want the honest answer or a comforting one? Honesty. Hit me with the truth. Hit me with the truth, baby. Your body was disappointed her daughter didn't marry an Indian. What? Wait, our dad's not Indian? And now her beloved granddaughter, despite her best efforts, is marrying someone even further from home. She's shifted her hopes onto you, the remaining grandchild. So Aroni is also not marrying an Indian? Is he white? Maybe a little too much truth there, Auntie Chandra. Ugh, just what I need. More annoying people. Thank God Bhakti's 8,000 miles away. That should give me some breathing space. Uh, Jala, you know Arani's getting married in a month, right? <laughs> Damn, girl, I didn't notice this, but look at her hands, guys. Look at how she freaking tosses that goddamn bell. Girl, if I had your upper arm strength, God, who in the Lord knows what I'd be able to do. She is strong. Why lift her much? Oh my God. Yes, my dear. But he's coming here to Timber Hills. Oh, that's not good. She'll be here at the end of the month. Sorry, sweetie. Oh, if I know any Asian aunt, uh, grandmothers, they are scary. How about I clean up that skateboard of yours? Maybe it'll make you feel better. Hmm? Yes, please. Ooh, can I have a different color? I want purple. I don't really like the blue. Do you give more, us more colors, like green? That would be... Indeed. Whoa, look at that. Look at Auntie Chantra. Oh, look how heavy those are. Those are tires. Look at her legs. Oh, she can do the splits mid-air. Damn, true butch lesbian. You need to open the gear menu to equip shoes, jackets, and boards. Oh, okay, thank you, Uncle Hinti. Let me see. Ew. Oh, my scooper actually changed. That is lit, boy. Oh, my scooper actually turned purple. Can I have a green, please? Who's calling me? Oh, Papa. I mean, Apache. Jala, I have a great idea. A brainwave. Can you come home now? I was gonna skate. I was thinking of heading to the skate park, Daddy. Do that tomorrow, hmm? For me? Ah, oh, fine. You're so wit. He's my favorite papa. My only papa. I'll see you at home, party doa, and bring your appetite. Fine. I was trying to for my sister, but okay, papa, apache. Select a skater. Huh? We can select a skater here? Okay. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Oh, we can skate here too. Bye there.
Don't open the present in eyes. If they're all lies, I'm not sure, but don't open it. We're going home to see Papa. Papa! Talk to Dad in recipes. Tender heroes. <laughs>